दोस्तों आज हम लोग एक नॉन यूनिफॉर्मिटी के प्रॉब्लम के ऊपर काम करेंगे दिस प्रॉब्लम इज फ्रॉम द टॉपिक इलास्टिसिटी एंड दिस प्रॉब्लम हैज गॉट द टेपर्ड रॉड आई विल शो यू हाउ टू डील विद द टेपर्ड रॉड इफ वी वॉन्ट द इलांगेशन ऑफ द रॉड let us read the question first a body of mass 3.14 kg is suspended from one end of wire of length 10 meter a tapered wire the radius of cross section of this wire is changing from 5 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter at the top that is at the point of suspension To 9.8 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter at the bottom. Young modulus of elasticity is 2 into 10 to the power 11 newton per meter square. The change in length of the wire is. So, so here basically, this tapered wire is. This tapered wire hanging me. This tapered wire, friends, is hanging from the ceiling. and it has got some weight over it now notice that this tapered wire is assumed to be massless here either it is massless or i will say it is so light that the elongation caused by its own weight is negligible so by assuming that friends we are assuming that it has got the same elongating force on both sides the elongating force on both side is same yahan pe main ek bar isko clear karna chahta hu ki agar ye tapered wire jisse ye mass hang kiya gaya hai ये अगर मान लीजिए खुद वायर का मास इतना होता कि उसका इलांगेशन जो है वो सिग्निफिकेंट होता ड्यू टू इट्स ओन वेट तो फिर इलांगेटिंग फोर्स वायर के दोनों साइड में सेम नहीं आते इन दिस केस वी आर एज्यूमिंग दैट द वायर इज लाइट दैट इज the elongation caused by its own weight is almost negligible now let us proceed <clears throat> now we know that the modulus of elasticity is y is equal to stress divided by strain so this f is not divided by a delta l so the formula of delta l that is elongation would be If L not divided by y a. Now this a here is the area of cross section if the wire is uniform throughout. If uniform cross section. This is what is the basic formula that we know. Now whenever the wire has got the taper, friends. what we can do is we can use the technique of geometric mean area gma geometric mean area the effective uniform area to be considered so that the elongation is same is nothing but friends geometric mean area gma kisi bhi cheez ka agar dosto geometric mean nikalna hai तो हम लोग क्या करते हैं स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ x1 x2 करते हैं जैसे दोस्तों अरिथमेटिक मीन ऑफ x1 एंड x2 जो होता है दट इज x1 वन प्लस एक्स टू डिवाइडेड बाई टू बिल्कुल ऐसे ही जोमेट्रिक मीन ऑफ x इज इक्वल टू स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ x1 x2 सो so, जी एम ए इज इक्वल टू ए वन ए टू तो यहां पे देखिए ये जो एरिया है ये एरिया चेंज हो रहा है पाई ए स्क्वायर एट वन एंड 
to pi b square at the other end. Therefore, the geometric mean area would be pi a b, and this area would be taken as effective area of cross section, which is uniform throughout. So this is how this pi a b is taken. If L not divided by यहाँ पे गलती से ये y हुआ है, so a हुआ है, यहाँ पे दोस्तों y होना चाहिए. So this is what is the effective area of uniform rod, which will replace the given tapered rod, okay, in the context of same elongation. <coughs> Now sir. ये क्या आपने बता दिया इसलिए क्या हम लोग मानेंगे क्या इसका प्रूफ है दोस्तों इसका प्रूफ हम लोगों को करना पड़ेगा कैलकुलस से जिसको इंटरेस्ट है वो देखेगा जिसको इंटरेस्ट नहीं है वो छोड़ दीजिए देखिए कैलकुलस से मैं इसका प्रूफ दिखाता हूं आपको दिस वाई इज वाई इज द रेडियस एट एनी एक्स फ्रॉम द लेफ्ट एंड I repeat, y is the radius of the cross section at any x. X is the distance from the left end. So this y is equal to friends a plus x tan theta by using the y is equal to m x plus c, where you know m is the slope. Okay, friends, so slope, right? So this is slope. Hai, if you see, then this is b minus a divided by l. That is nothing but tan theta, which is a constantly tapering rod. So, would like to know the elemental, the key elemental elongation of elemental rod having the thickness dx and cross section area pi y square. So, I am applying this particular formula on elemental basis. So it is pi y square here. Pi y square is the area of cross section, and a length l naught is dx. Look here, l naught is the original length. What I was told. General formula me is l naught ko maine replace kiya hai dx se. Mujhe dx s dx short dx length ka jo yahan pe dosto rod hai ya fir wire hai. इसका मुझे इलांगेशन चाहिए मतलब एलिमेंटल इलांगेशन चाहिए ऑफ एलिमेंटल लेंथ डीएक्स सो फॉर दैट परपस आई हैव सब्स्टिट्यूटेड हियर डीएक्स नाउ आई हैव सब्स्टिट्यूटेड दिस वाई इज इक्वल टू ए प्लस एक्स टेन थीटा देन इफ आई डू द इंटीग्रेशन फ्रॉम जीरो टू एल आई विल गेट द कंप्लीट इलांगेशन ऑफ द रॉड सो Thereafter, I will do the integration here. I have done integration here, friends, and uh, I have substituted the values. Okay, many of the values substitute. Okay, beta tan theta is equal to b minus a by l. If we are going to substitute here, then this will be b minus a will come. Here, I have done tan theta ka substitution, kiya hai, and you will get friends pi into a b. So in this way. There is a proof of this that this is the area effective in this case would be GMA geometric mean area. Once it is done, friends, then you can substitute these values. Three point one four kg is the mass. Then G is given to you. Ten meter is the length. So there are two diameters, two two radius nine point eight and five. You. Substitute all the values respectively, and you will get the answer, friends. One mm. Okay. Thank you.